Okay, so, hi. I'm here to show you how to solve algebraic equations. So before we solve an algebraic equation, we gotta know what an algebraic equation is. So, um, an algebraic equation is a number sentence that contains at least one variable, which we'll talk about variables later in this video, and uses the equal sign to show that to ex express expressions if I could write today expressions are equivalent so I can just leave that for a sec and uh, write down the definition okay um, so now we gotta show you what a variable is so basically a variable is very important in algebraic equations, so if we write down an algebraic equation, which is 2a plus 7, which is just a really easy equation. So this a is a variable, and a variable is, if I could spell it right, um, a letter or symbol used to represent a so it's normally a letter like X or U or A or Y or you know whatever so you've written that down so let's solve an algebraic equation so okay. um, so let's solve an algebraic equation so this is the algebraic equation that we've chosen today um, so it's 20 plus 10x equals 20, 28 plus 8x. So first, first thing you want to do is you want to draw x down the line, and that's just easier for me. So in an algebraic equation, you want to get the <laughs> variables on one side and the numbers on the other side. So you want to draw a v, or you don't have to do this, it's just a thing that you're supposed to that you want to do. Um, so first thing you want to do is you want to get all the numbers and those variables on one side, which I already said. Um, so um, you have to minus stuff from each side. And um, I mean, if it was negative, never mind. Um, so you want to minus 20 from this, because it's a lower number. And then what you do to one side, you have to do the other. So you have to do minus 20 on this side. So then you draw a line, and then you have to move everything down. So this is zero now, because those have canceled out. So now this is just 10x. And now this is, um, this is now eight, and this is eight x. Yeah, so, and then you deal with the, the variable thing. So you minus eight from this side, what you do to one side, you do to the other, so you do that, and then you move everything down. So this is zero, and now this is two x, and this is eight. So now you have to divide because you have to find like x, so you do x because this is, because you would divide by two because it's two x, so this is one, so then you would divide eight by two, which equals four. So that's how.